Star of the Valley Brittany Cartwright talked candidly about her rivalry with Lala Kenta Vanderpump Rules. On the Friday, June 7th edition of her podcast, When Reality Hits, which she co-hosts with co-star and husband Jax Taylor, Cartwright said, I'm just going to say this short and sweet because I didn't know that she was going to talk about that on the reunion. That kind of surprised me because, by then, both she and I had already expressed our regrets to each other. I was a little taken aback, even though we were all right. As example, why is this being discussed at the reunion? Bravo aired the third installment of the season 11 reunion of Vanderpump Rules on May 28. At the reunion, Kent, 33, said that the text interaction between Cartwright, 35, and Lala Burningham's mother, Lisa Burningham, was the starting point of her issue with Cartwright. The Valley actress had questioned Burningham about why she had taken on Cruz, Cartwright and Taylor's three-year-old son, as a nanny. On the day of my gender reveal, Britney acted so out of pocket, Lala said to host Andy Cohen during the reunion. She was so f king broke when she reached out to my mom. Do not text my mother on the day I find out we are expecting a girl and ask, did you really hire our nanny without our permission, she continued. First of all, she stated, I have Jax yelling at me, while you and your son Cruz are in Kentucky. Well, then you need to get Jax to call me so I can eat him alive instead, I replied. As she and Lala have since made up, Brittany said on, when reality hits, that she didn't really understand why the argument came up again at the VPR reunion. Cartwright went on, I would never be rude or mean to anybody, let me make that very clear. I do love Lala, and my mistake was writing the text message. However, I should not have written the message on that particular day, that was my error. I said I was sorry right away. Cartwright went on to reveal that she and Jax had to search for a nanny for Cruz for a long time, as their baby needs certain people that are constant and in his life. The event sounded way worse on the reunion, she added, than what had actually occurred. There is just our nanny, Jax, and me at this place. It was significant to me because of this, she remarked. It has nothing to do with anything else. I would have said, yes, of course, go for it, if I had known or asked. For the day, use her. Simply said, it had more shock value. Jax and I were already in such a horrible place, so I just kind of wrote a message on a day that I shouldn't have, she said in closing. However, we had already made amends and moved on from the incident. Regarding Kent, during her May 31st Amazon Live, the VPR star said, TBD, when asked if she and Cartwright were still at odds. That response is appealing.